Good morning, Pre-K. How are you? I miss you so much. I hope you've had the best Christmas, and I hope you got to play in the snow. I can't wait to hear all about it. Speaking of snow, we're going to read a book about snowflakes. The title is called Snowflakes Fall. The author is Patricia McLaughlin, and the artist that drew the pictures, his name is Stephen Kellogg. After the flowers are all gone, snowflakes fall. Flake after flake after flake. Each one a pattern all on its own. No two the same, but they're all beautiful. Look how pretty these pictures are. See those kids playing in the snow? Snowflakes fall to sit on gardens and evergreen trees. On the fur of dogs and the tongues of laughing children. No two the same, but all beautiful. So much fun those kids and dogs are having. My doggy loves to play in the snow. Snowflakes fall, drift, and swirl together like the voices of children. Snowflakes fall on a winding river sandy bank. Isn't that so pretty? On a hilltop town, on its ancient church, on its loved library, and its familiar flagpole. When snowflakes fall at night, wailing winds may blow, and frantic icy snowflakes scratch the window glass. Branches fly and shadows darken dreams. But then, when we wake in the morning light, surprise, the world shines. Snowflakes fall to quilt meadows, so we see the wandering prints of birds, rabbits, and the bobcat at dawn. Look how excited that boy was to see the snow in the morning. You see the animal footprints in the snow? And the footprints of small red boots making sled paths. Did your snow boots make prints in the snow when you got to play? <clears throat> and snowmen and fords and fields of snow angels. Look at those snowmen. And those kids making snow angels, that is so much fun. And when the snowflakes melt in the quiet sun, they fill the chattering streams, flowing, rushing, sending drops of water up to fall as rain. Snow's melting away like ours did. On places where the snowflakes had been, where soon flowers will grow again. And when the flowers bloom, the children will remember the snowflakes. So after this snowy season, we'll start to see flowers in the spring. And we remember the children, no two the same, but all beautiful. And that's the end. I hope you guys have a great weekend, and I can't wait to see you on Monday. Bye.